Hello and welcome to the Retro Tech 100 Facebook page's 20p arcade challenge. This week, it's Raiden. No, not Raiden from Mortal Kombat 11, I've seen way too much of his face lately. No, it's not the little blonde haired boy from Metal Gear Solid 2 either that disappointed a nation, or, or the world actually, until he totally redeemed himself in Metal Gear Solid Revengeance. No, we're talking about the 1990 vertically scrolling shooter, Raiden. <clears throat> now, it's not one of my favourite games, it's a good game, but it wasn't one of my favourites ever. I think mostly because there's no auto fire and my fingers can't move quick enough to to shoot as quick as I would like to. Um, but I did play this quite a lot back in the day. I'm rusty now. I don't remember any of the, the bullet patterns or anything. Uh, but I used to play it a lot because I had it on the Atari Jaguar. Yes, I was an Atari Jaguar owner pretty much from launch. And uh, I quite like my Jag. I think it's an underrated little bit of kit. There were some good games on the Jag, and the machine had potential, it was just... It just couldn't compete with the big boys, really, could it? It was just a victim of its own bad timing. Um, but the machine had potential, and some of the games that were released on it, like Alien vs Predator, Tempest 2000, showed that potential quite well, as well as a virtually arcade perfect conversion such as this. Yeah, it was virtually arcade perfect on the Jag. Um, in fact, it was probably more arcade perfect than the PlayStation version that came out later, uh, the Raiden Project, um, because of memory constraints and whatnot and resolution issues. That wasn't quite arcade perfect. Everything kind of had a squishy look to it. Um, still very good, but not perfect. I also had this on the uh, Atari Lynx, and the Atari Lynx was a great little game. It wasn't arcade perfect, and you wouldn't expect it to be really, but it played a very good game. That's all that mattered really, in a handheld. Ooh. I need to get that bomb. Did I get it? Yeah, I got it. For some reason, I never use the bombs in this game. I think it's because there's such a delay to them. You can't use them as a last resort. You have to uh, kind of pre-plan when you're going to actually use it. Because the bombs don't take away the enemy bullets on the screen at the, at the exact time that you pop it. There's a, a bit of a bit of a delay. So you have to plan in advance. And I'm not good at planning. I'm not good at planning at all. Planning's no fun. I just like to shoot stuff. Whee. Easy tiger. Okay, here we go. Whoa. That was close. Whoa. Okay, that's one down. Mmm. Back to the pea shooter. I knew there were reasons why it wasn't my favourite shmup. Or one of my favourites. Ugh, gotta beat the boss with this puny little thing now. And I lost my extra bomb, I didn't fire it. But I've lost it. Shit. Okay, that's not cool. Come on, you should at least let me have my extra bomb. You bastard. Oh, shit. Woo! Okay, one down. Damn it! <clears throat> Sorry, coming. Couldn't move. Don't tell me this is going to be a level one and done thing. Come on, I, I refuse that. I've got to get to level two, at least. Hey! There's 
one. Yeah. Why couldn't you do that two lives ago, huh? <clears throat> There we go, level one clear. Bing, bing, bing. Okay, my eye is itching. That's that's not boding well. Extra challenge mode. Oh shit! Oh, I picked a bad spot. Now where's the other medals coming from? There's more medals on these buildings somewhere. I can't remember where. And I haven't really got time to look for them. Hey! Oh, there they are. There they are. Right, okay. Ooh. Get out of it. <clears throat> okay. We survived. Do we survive? Or are we surviving? Shit! Speaking too soon. Ah, uh, crap. Losing sight of the enemy bullets, that's never a good thing. Mm. Extra life? Thank you very much. Just what the doctor ordered. Ah, shit. Ah. Okay, that's not so bad. I don't stop from too far back. But I've got this pathetic little gun. How am I supposed to do any damage with this? Go, 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 go. Okay. <clears throat> now we've only got a semi pathetic gun. Stand a chance once more. Ooh. Are we going to wait for that to change to a laser? I don't like the multi shot <clears throat> in this game. I, I don't think it fires quick enough to really be useful. So I stick with the old laser throughout the whole game, pretty much. Which ends right now. <clears throat> so there we go, I got to the overhead train isometric section with the endless V-shaped monsters. Oh, was that my first credit? Yeah, that was. That was my first credit. Woohoo! <clears throat> we'll see where the checkpoint leads. Okay, so that's credit one. Your second and final credit. Okay, we're back at the edge of the bridge. And I am in dire need of that power up. Come on, change to a laser. Thank you. Okay, so we start from here pretty much where we died and where we're gonna die again soon I think these enemies are far too quick for this pathetic little gun to actually make a dent in Whew. boss time
Oh, that ain't cool. Not cool at all, guys. No. Damn it. Oh, back from here. You bastards. Could have at least dropped me off at the boss. so well. I'm kind of boxed in. I don't like being boxed in. Okay, back to the boss. Three bombs, small lasers, couple of missiles. Let's do this. Let's get it done. Okay, that's all the bombs gone. Slag! No! So close! I'll sacrifice a bit of maneuverability to just get slightly faster shooting with my other firing technique bollocks didn't work okay so we made it to the boss of level 1-2 and then got absolutely obliterated multiple times but there we go that's the way it goes I was hoping to kill the boss but can't always get what we hope for right oh well could have been worse could have been worse so my highest score was 185220. We made it to the end of level 1-2. That's the end of my challenge, folks. Let's see if you guys can do any better. Jump onto the RetroTech 100 Facebook page, submit your score, make a video, upload it to your YouTube, and compete. It's only for shits and giggles. It's only for bragging rights, but it's a lot of fun. I hope you'll join us on the next one. Until then, bye for now.